Oh gosh. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> You know, honestly, I, I didn't play Earthbound when I was a kid, but if I had heard this, like, this intro when I was a child, I would have been horrified. <laughs> but this is Earthbound, guys. Um. Ooh. Why is my recording thing not showing? Okay, cool. Uh, this is Earthbound. I've actually never played Earthbound. I played a little bit of this game before, but, um... I never actually got too deep into it, so I'm actually really excited to play this today. Um, alright, let's start new game. Uh, tech speed fast. Uh, and stereo. Let's see, mint, strawberry, banana, and peanut. Let's go with plan. Please name him. Well, my name's Crash. And I like it when people yell my name, so it's... CRASH! In all caps. Oh, he looks so happy. He looks so excited to be named Crash. Uh, name her too. Uh, I don't really care what your name is. Paula, I guess your name's Paula. Hi, Paula. You, what's your name? Jeff? Sup, Jeff? And this loser, his name is... Oh. Pooh. His name's Pooh. Um, I am gonna name my pet. I'm gonna name him after my cat. Uh, Cuddles. He's right there. Hi, Cuddles. He doesn't love me very much. Uh, so, uh, but I'm still gonna name him that. Um. Oh, uh, it doesn't fit. Uh, I'm gonna put a Z. Cuddles. Cause I'm a cool kid. Did that just... Huh. Uh, my favorite food? Uh, well, my favorite food is sushi. I love sushi. It's my favorite thing in the world. My favorite thing? Um... I don't know what my favorite thing is. Uh, stuff? Stuff. Stuff is my favorite thing. Ah... Uh, uh, yeah, my favorite, yes, yeah, that's, that seems like me, yeah, the coolest thing in the world is stuff. Yes, I am sure. And like I said, I have played, I've played the beginning of this game up until the, um, honestly up until the fly comes in I know there's a fly that's really all I know about the game and then you fight like a star man that's all I remember that's literally all I remember of this game I could be wrong about the whole thing so let's just I, I'm just gonna shut up and get into it looks like it's a nice and quiet night in Onet I do know the place is called Onet because the little sign said it was Onet <laughs> and plus I played Smash Bros I have played Smash Bros, and I know in, it's Crash's house. It's my home. What's up? It's us. I'm asleep. Did oh oh that doesn't sound very good. Oh, all right, Crash. Let's go. I really like the art style of this game because it's like I know it takes place in like kind of just normal world the normal world but slight variations of it just it just looks really interesting to me it looks really cool um I was going to here I do know you're supposed to go in here and get a bat I do know that I remember that hello sister are you not gonna speak to me speak to me hey bro did you did the sound wake you up? Were you freaked out? Can I not just talk to her? I'm pretty sure... Oh, whatever. Can I not just pick things up? Oh, there we go. Cracked bat. Crash takes it. That's weird. That's such a weird... Huh. That's strange. Um... So it looks like L is, like, actions... This is really neat, because I am playing this on the Wii U. 
And if I wanted to, I could just look at my little screen. That's really cool. But other than that, I'm just going to look at my TV. Hello, mother. What was that noise? Crash! You don't seem scared. Are you nuts? And now you want to check it out? Oh, okay. You'll sneak out of your room anyway, even if I ask you not to. At least change out of your jammies before you go. Aw, that sounds just like my mom. Like, she knows I'm just gonna go out and do hoodlum stuff. But she just wants me to be safe. I feel like I messed up the controls on this. I feel like... L should not be... L should not be my attack. Or my, my action command. That just seems kind of weird. Whatever. Let's just go and see what's going on. Doggy? I know if you talk to your dog, he comes with you. Besides humans, dogs... Oh, no, I guess not. I guess that's later. I, I know... Yeah, like I said, I've played a little bit of this before. So I know a little bit about what's going on. Ooh, I can use the control stick. That seems a lot easier. I'm just going to use a control pad. Uh, hello, officer. Officer? You don't know what time it is. Get your butt home pronto. Um, no, I'm not gonna do anything you tell me to. I'm a rebel. A meteorite has landed. The sharks are running wild in town. You kids, you kids are wandering around and I'm hungry. I hate my job. That's what's wrong with police nowadays. They just care about their jobs more so than just being civil servants. Do your job, homie. It's dangerous to go on the hilltop. Even if I advise you not to go, it won't stop you, will it? No. No, it won't. Because I'm the main character of this anime. I see what's over here. Hello, sir. Hi, you. Don't you know what time it is? Yes, I do. I'm well aware what time it is. But I don't care. Because I don't sleep, you fool. Crash opened the present. There was a bread roll inside. Crash takes it. Yes, yum, it's mine. I'm assuming that's a healing item. So I'm not going to use that until later. Hey, Crash, hiya, buddy. A meteorite fell down, went boom. It was a real mess for a while. That was fine because I always eat garlic and work out to help my body grow stronger. However, the weaker citizens probably fainted. I also wanted to tell you... Whoops. I almost told you my... Uh, by the way, Crash, did I... Did you check out my billboard? I wrote the message myself. That's my real job, you know. I'm a billboard guy. Why don't you check it out? Why don't you check out my work? You're hiding something. I can tell you're hiding something from me. Not, you seem ominous. Treasure Hunter. This is... I'm not going to pronounce it. Lear X Age Rate's house? Age Rate. That's, that's what it looks like. That's what I'm going to say. I feel like you're going to be important later. A meteorite looks different than usual. It's strange and marvelous, as well as mysterious. Ooh. You're weird. Um, hello, officer. Shush, shush. Don't shush me. Clear out. Get out of the way. Clear out. Get out of the way. Clear out. Go out of the way. You're just going to keep saying that? Whoops, my mistake. I mean, get out of my way. What? You're rude. Nice timing, Crash. Will you do something about Pokey? He's driving me nuts. Are you two friends? No. You're not friends? But aren't you neighbors? Hey, just because we're neighbors doesn't mean we're friends. That don't mean nothing. I'm assuming you're Pokey? What do you want? What are you doing? Stop bothering them. Hey, Crash. Don't be rubbernecking. You're getting in the cops. Oops. I mean, officer's way. You can go home now. Tomorrow, I, Pokey, will tell you more about the meteorite. I'm fine here, but you're bugging the officers. Really doesn't seem that way, but I guess if that's what's... If you're not going to let me through, if you're not going to let me through, I guess I'll just go home. Let's go, Crash. They obviously don't want us here, so we're just going to go home. And sleep and not worry about any of this cuz cuz we don't care hey how you hello hey person maybe you want to talk to us did you hear the big bang I think a meteorite landed nearby I want to be the first to see it okay I'm going to try to be the first to get there hmm 
Something about you just something about these characters just make me feel very uncomfortable. Like I I feel like there's something they're all hiding. Hello? Hello. I'm so sleepy. Mom and Dad haven't gotten back from town yet. Pokey ran out and he hasn't returned. I'm thinking about going to bed. It's probably best for you, dude. Your brother's kind of a dick. Is there something in here for me to steal? I'm rummaging through your stuff. Nope, nothing here for me. There's no problems. I can assure you, Picky, that there is nothing going on upstairs. There's nothing of value upstairs. I can assure you that. Very much so. Do, 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 do. Oh, hey, persons. I want to return home, but the road is closed. People are taking this meteorite situation too seriously. Well, it's a meteorite. I mean, police are famous for closing rooms if something is going on. We're here. We're here for the world record. If that's really all you're worried about, then that's really, really. There's something wrong with the police force. Don't panic. This is just a what meteorite? That who fell? I just want to what go home. All right, whatever. If that's really what you care about, another billboard. He did say something about billboards. South of the sun. Oh, well, I guess that didn't really. I thought. I thought it meant something. Hi, mom. Welcome home, Crash. It's not necessary to talk about tonight. It's late. Scoot off to bed. Yeah, I guess. Everyone else is being kind of a jerk to us. So we're just gonna go to bed and sleep. Later that night. Oh, someone's knocking on our door. Stop. Okay, one thing that pisses me off is when people come to my house unannounced. Like, if you're gonna come to my house, you need to at least shoot me a text or some shit. Because if you're gonna knock on my door at the middle of this night, that's horseshit. Let's see who the fuck this is. I swear to fuck, Pokey, if this is you. This is you again, Pokey. I'm gonna beat your ass. Someone's knocking at the door. What an annoying knock. You got that right, sister. Mom? My land, who could it be knocking at the door at this time of night? Would you answer it? Yes, mother, I will answer it. Doggy? Don't even let me open the door, Pokey. Just, no, just come right in. That's fine. That's okay. Hey, hey, listen. What I've got to say. When I took Picky to the place where the meteorite landed. Oh, good evening, ma'am. You're looking as lovely as usual. <laughs> Alright, Pokey, stop being creepy. Anyway, as I was saying, the police that were guarding the meteorite suddenly left to deal with the sharks. You know the sharks? They're the local ruffians. And they were really going wild. Suddenly I noticed that Picky was gone. I blame the cops. It certainly wasn't my fault at all. When my dad get back, gets back, I know I'm gonna get it. You're my bestest friend. Won't you help me find Picky? No. If you refuse, I'll say that you'll... That you... What? If you s refuse me, I'll say something that'll cut you like a knife. No. No. Okay, I won't say anything to hurt you. Will you please come with me? No. If you refuse me, I'll say something that will cut you like a knife. I'm assuming he's just gonna keep saying that, so yeah, fine, whatever will help you. Okay, good buddy, let's blow this popsicle stand. Before we go, why don't you say goodbye to your mom? Don't you agree, ma'am? You are a manipulative piece of shit, aren't you, Pokey? Sister, what do you have to say? I'll do everything I can help you. Good luck on your adventure. I don't even want to go. Oh, thanks for the cookie. You're a good sister. Do you want me to hang on to something? No, I'm good for now. I'm assuming she just holds our items. Mother? I know that dog is unreliable, but you should take Cuddles along. You are very unreliable, Cuddles. He's just staring at me. The cracked bot in Tracy's room could help out at a time like this. See, I already got it, Mom. I am 
way ahead of you. I love stealing things. Oh, hey, I changed into my clothes. Is there anything in here that I could take? I already got the bat, so I'm not gonna... Oh, wait, did I get the bat? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Um, equip. Yeah, I got the bat. Let's go. Um, whatever. Uh, she did say to take cuddles with us. You want me to go along with you? Yes! I guess I have no choice. Let's go. Cuddles joined you! Yay! Cuddles, we're going on an adventure! He's not very pleased. Um, Pokey, what do you want? Alright, let's go in front. You go out in front, and I'll follow at a safe distance. Let's go along. He's a coward, isn't he? Pokey joins you. Um, alright, I guess we have our crew. Let's go on. Oh, the phone. Hello? 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 Crash answered the phone. Hello, it's your dad. Work to exhaustion when you're young. Have you ever heard that saying? Or saying like this? Just remember, I'm always behind you 100%. Don't be afraid. I know that you're brave. You can do it. Don't forget to call me periodically during your adventure. I can make a record of your progress when you call me. Oh yeah, I deposited $30 into your bank account. Do you have your ATM card? Withdraw your money from any ma cash machine to buy it whatever you need. Good luck, my boy. I feel like such a hero. What? Well, the father of a hero, at least. <laughs> Slam. Beep. Well, I guess that's the perfect time to end things off. Um, I'm gonna save, and then if you guys... I'm really liking this game already. It's really interesting. I like these characters. I hate Pokey. I'm sure he's gonna betray us because he's a coward. I know it already. I can tell. But if you like this video, comment, rate, subscribe. If you want to watch, I'm um, upload another episode of this tomorrow. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I love you. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.